The Northrop XB-35 and YB-35 were experimental heavy bomber aircraft, developed by the Northrop Corporation for the U.S. Army Air Forces, during and shortly after World War II. They used a flying wing design, without a traditional tail and fuselage. Northrop began exploring flying wing designs in the 1930s. In 1941, before the attack on Pearl Harbor, Northrop and Consolidated Vultee Corporation were commissioned to develop a large, long-range bomber. Northrop wanted to explore a flying wing design to reduce parasitic drag and to eliminate unnecessary structural weight, while Consolidated Vultee wanted to explore a more traditional design. Northrop was convinced that their B-35 design would be able to carry a greater payload faster, farther and cheaper than traditional designs. Both Northrop and Consolidated Vultee were awarded prototype contracts. The intention was to produce a bomber that would be able to bomb Nazi-occupied Europe from bases in America, in the event that Britain was defeated. One XB-35 prototype was ordered from Northrop in November 1941, with an option for a second aircraft. The second prototype was eventually ordered, and the first aircraft was to be delivered in November 1943, with the second following in April 1944. The crew cabin on the aircraft was to be embedded inside the wing, and in the tail cone there would be remote sighting stations for bombers and gunners. There would be several rear-firing machine guns. The cabin would also have bunks for off-duty crew during long missions. Bombs would be carried in six smaller bomb bays. The aircraft would have 20.5-inch machine guns or 20mm cannons for defense, in six turrets. The XB-35 made its first flight in June 1946. After a number of test flights, vibrations from the engine and propellers became a problem. Propellers failed frequently and there was a problem finding anyone willing to take responsibility for solving the issue. Eventually, Jack Northrop decided to ground the XB-35 until the problems were worked out by the government. In September 1943, 13 pre-production YB-35s were ordered by the Army Air Forces. However it took until May 15, 1948 until the first YB-35 made its first flight. Only one YB-35 was completely finished, the second was scrapped before it was finished and the remaining 11 were converted to use other power plants. Two of the intended YB-35 airframes were converted to YB-49s, using eight Allison J-35 jet engines. Seven other airframe began conversion to jet-powered YB-49Bs, but were never finished. Another airframe was converted to use six jet engines, and was designated YRB-49A. There were also plans to convert one YB-35 to use turboprop engines, but the project was cancelled. The B-35 project was cancelled due to many technical issues, and because of its obsolete piston engines. The project had also gone far behind schedule and over the intended budget. <laughs> <laughs>